My name is Charmino Becinoe. My name is Rajiv Day. I'm Lisa Witter. I'm Heather Fleming. My name is Tui. I'm Esteban Bullrich. My name is Sheila Lirio Marcello. A young global leader is a bold, brave, action-oriented, entrepreneurial leader who decided to use their leadership talents to make the world a better place. I'm a documentary filmmaker from Pakistan. And I'm the founder of Internships.com. I'm the Minister of Education of the City of Buenos Aires. I'm founder and CEO of Care.com. I'm the CEO of Vingo, the largest real estate developer in Vietnam. A product design firm working to commercialize new products and services for the poor. And I'm a partner in a company that does communications for non profits and social issues. They're more open to entrepreneurial ideas. They're more willing to take risks at this stage of their career. We created the Forum of Young Global Leaders because we saw an aching need in the world for more collaboration. The key thing is to start now. The Young Global Leaders community is about what we're doing to give back and make a difference in the world. It's very important to be connected to a group of young leaders around the world, to learn from their expertise, to take help from them, to understand how they tackle issues in their own countries. And it's just such a fantastic community, very diverse, from all walks of life. It's been a mind expansion. I thought that it would be for networking, that people would come and exchange business cards and that would be it. But it's so much deeper than that. This year's class of 200 leaders comes from 70 different countries. 42% of them are women. These are leaders who are not only working in their individual fields, but have also come together to collaborate on world-changing projects. One of the things you learn being in this community is that we are responsible for making the world a better place for our kids. I still feel like I have so much more to do. I, I feel like I, I can add more value. And there's no better way to accelerate cross-pollination of ideas than by being exposed on a regular basis to thought leaders in different parts of the world. Looking at what they have achieved, it really inspires me to get better. We've built really strong friendships. If you have friendships, you have trust. And you need that if you're really going to change the world.